Hello my fellow YouTubians, this is Pool Shark Wizard, and today we are doing a dedication to my pops. Um, the moon looks a little different here because I have installed Doc M77's uh, texture pack, and I'll leave a link to his channel in the description uh, so you can download the texture pack yourself. It's pretty darn cool. Uh, instead of having the squares for the moon and the sun, it actually looks real. And we've done a few updates. Uh, the updates we've done here, is, as I've said, is I wanted to throw up the lights up on top and to show you guys that it actually works. Um, I do have it on peaceful right now just because I, uh, I want just want to show you guys this stuff. So... Uh, when the uh, mobs spawn their stuff and uh, they die through here, when something goes down on the wooden pressure plate, we have the lights that go up on top, just like I've said I've wanted to do. It's not a bad setup. I have the wiring go underneath here, goes around to the back side, <clears throat> and I'm using torches to go up to the top of it. So this is a dedication to my pops because uh, it's been definitely over a year ago now um, where my dad got diagnosed with cancer. And I always call him pops because that's just, that's the way I call him. I don't call him dad, I call him pops for the most part. And the other part of it is it was his birthday on uh, July 20th. So I, um, I wanted to have this out earlier but uh, yeah it things came up and I was not able to uh, get it up earlier oops now we've got it here dang nabbit that's alright we'll just fix it quick um, but uh, basically yeah um, my dad uh, turned I think 63 I believe and I really wanted to do a video for my pops because it was his birthday and I know he watches all my YouTube videos so I want to tell you guys to say hey happy birthday or something to him um, it's, it's been over a year since he got diagnosed with cancer and he's doing pretty well now but uh, this is just total dedication for him and I figured it would be a really cool uh, birthday present basically because um, my dad really doesn't <laughs> like gifts all that much um, but I figured this would be a good way to do it so we're gonna start out and we're gonna go check out the mushroom farm I've done a couple of uh, improvements to it sort of and uh, I threw these lights in in the back side here I would like to have them so they can close off but I believe, as you can as you can see, it's definitely spawned mushrooms, so the light thing really isn't that bad. Um, and when you flick the when you flick this lever here, it opens up the doors, harvests all the mushrooms, and leaves the two uh, primary ones right there. So we'll get these mushrooms. We'll turn off the system, and we'll continue to let those things grow. Now. I would like to have this at night and to me um, uh, a while back on Facebook when I first found out about my dad having cancer I did a in Farmville I did a little something that said love you pops which in my opinion was super cool and uh, we're just gonna uh, let's you know what let's just take a ride we haven't taken a ride for a while so let's do that and as you can see uh, when I hit the inventory here right there it says Doc M77's Minecraft World Texture Pack and this is just a really cool uh, it's it's a really cool texture pack I mean um, it still has the standard uh, for the most part but there's definitely some changes it looks a little more high def and things like that so let me know if you guys like this texture pack or not um, we'll just ride this up to the station right about here and we will 
bust this thing out and get out. Now, um, I do feel, how do I want to do this? I don't want you guys, I don't want you guys to see the big surprise. So I'm just going to keep on looking down here until I get out to the point where I want it to uh, uh, be. And you probably got a good little view before. But here's the deal. So I have a blue block and I have a red block with levers on them. Hmm. I have the control room back here. I wonder what this thing does. Let's see. It just goes all the way back here. Um, it's pretty simple design and it goes into my little lava room here and let's see I wonder if you guys can recognize this area this is uh, my old area so we'll just take this all the way up to the top here and we'll see where this leads now if you guys have watched my series you know where this leads this leads up to my lookout tower so when we look down here we have the house and the mob system all that jazz and we'll take the ladder up here and we'll go out to my lookout tower so this is overlooking everything there's the house we built and um, I think that's probably because I threw something down on there but as you can see from up here I can tell that there's lights on and there's the uh, mob trap that we have set up there's the other ones there's the house over here we have our diving board and then we have uh, we have where the uh, waterfall would be so let's go take a look at what this do what this is doing yeah you guys probably noticed some redstone there you notice some torches so let's just go see what this does hmm what do you think it is guys think creatively here and it, I'd like you guys to leave a comment saying happy birthday to my pops or something like that granted this is a little bit belated because it was back on the uh, 20th so let's see let's close this door I'll walk back over here have my head down and we have blue and we have red now as you guys saw there was redstone and there was torches going on so this is a dedication to my pops so let's just take a look what I did here right there it says pops right there in diagonal um, for me this is uh, really special because I do call them pops and I figured this would be a great birthday present and you guys may notice that I don't have any water and there's some lava up at the top so hmm let's flick this lever the blue one what's gonna happen oh is that the waterfall coming down it is oh so there's the waterfall and it has pops right behind it and I'm gonna do a view and you get you guys can see the Sun it's not square because this is Doc M's uh, texture pack and now well what what do you think this red one does red usually means fire um, stuff like that so let's flick it let's see what happens here oh what's that looks like a whole lot of lava coming down <clears throat> um, this is I, I spent a lot of time on this. It's a pretty simple design, but it took a lot of uh, work to get it to this point. And the thing that's kind of sucky about it is the uh, water goes away a lot faster than the lava does. But I have the lava going right down, so it's going to highlight the functional kitchen, which was way back in one of my earlier episodes. And uh, we can turn off the water here. And we'll see the water just kind of slowly go down and we have a solid backing of the lava how cool is that guys leave me a comment let me know um, like I said this is a total dedication and you know it's say my dad's a cancer survivor 
and uh, means my family means a lot to me. So uh, definitely leave some comments uh, saying happy birthday, even though this is late because it took me longer than I wanted to and other things came up. And that's just the way it works out. So I'm going to cut the video here and I'm going to start it up again when it's nighttime. So I'll see you guys shortly. Hang tight. Hey guys, we are back and it's nighttime as promised. Um, this is... Uh, this is my dedication to my pops, um, as I've mentioned before. And now that it's nighttime, we're going to switch on the water. And let's see how this works out. So we'll make the water flow again. Goes across the top. And uh, if you guys have watched us so far, uh, leave a comment saying uh, happy birthday. And my dad's name is Jerry. So if there's a comment left that says happy birthday Jerry, I know that you guys watch this towards the end here. So we're just going to let this run. And guys, I really appreciate it. Uh, spread the word because uh, leave a like, leave a comment. Uh, let me know what you guys think of this. I think it's, I think it's pretty special. I've done some uh, uh, different things with the functional kitchen here. I, normally I have the crafting bench right even with it, but I put it on the ground because I want to be able to walk through it here. So guys, uh, let me know what you guys think, and the next videos will probably be the uh, Let's Play. So here's our storage room, which I had a long time ago, and I've now made a lava wall, basically. And, uh, yeah, we'll just, uh, we'll go out here again. We'll take a look. And I think I'll end the video there. So, guys, leave a comment saying, Happy Birthday, Jerry. And, uh, then I know I got your guys' support. And let me know if you think this is a really cool thing. I think it's a really cool thing. Um, it definitely means a lot to me. So, uh, it's, uh, a little bit more on the emotional side for myself but I appreciate you guys watching and uh, leave me a comment leave me a like uh, saying happy birthday Jerry or something to that effect um, I would definitely appreciate it and the next video will be uh, the let's play series not sure what I'm going to do quite yet, so you guys could also leave another comment saying, hey, uh, give me some ideas on what I should do in the next one. But I will come back to this world on occasion. Um, you know, if I want to do something where, uh, I, you know, I don't need to be legit and I don't need to have, you know, I can just basically uh, spawn all my stuff. Um but the Let's Play series is totally legit. And some of the ideas that I have going on uh, for the next episode would be making a home base. Maybe starting a slime farm. I found this, uh, well, a lot of people are using this program for a slime farm. So I could do a slime farm. I could do, I could redo the, uh, the mob spawning pads and I could do a killing mechanism in there uh, so leave me some comments let me know what you guys would like to see but uh, I look forward to seeing you guys again and thank you very much for watching my dedication to my pops have a great night bye